on our show court. Just a word about uh, the Babington for You app. See the QR code there. It will get you a whole host of goodies. Look up all your favourite players. It's got some great videos on there. Tournament information, how to get tickets. And you can follow matches in tournaments like these point by point, if you so wish. So, five matches in. As I say, still three to go. And it's women's doubles uh, coming next. Chen and Du of China against Fruagard and Tigerson of Denmark. Court officials just about to make their way out. And here's how the draw was panned out. Now, that other semi-final, you didn't see, it was on the other court. Uh, but Liu and Tan have knocked out the number five seeds, as you can see, in straight games in 42 minutes. So they await the winners. It could be an all-Chinese affair tomorrow here in Madrid. And for the Women's Women's Doubles semi-final, it is in first from China, Chen Fakui and Du Red or black? Red. First so meeting black between these two pairs, as you can see there. It's black. Serve, who's server? Do. Mic to receive? Yeah. Which side? Okay, good luck. So, Ken Feng Wei, runner-up in uh, three minor mixed doubles tournaments. And she actually won a, a Malaysian international mixed doubles event last year with uh, Cheng Xing. She's 22 years of age now. Wouldn't take too much notice of that high ranking. Doesn't really mean, uh, mean a great deal. And probably her more well-known partner, Du Yet. We'll get to see her in a moment. There we go. 25, actually got to number five in the world. You can see it there with uh, Lilian Yin Wei. And that was only three years ago. Actually won a world championship bronze with her in 2019. And they also won three world tour titles as a pair together, so that's a measure uh, of their ability. That's how they've reached this semi-final, and not without plenty of effort. Three games in both the second round and the quarter-final. Michael Fugard, who's 27 years of age, Ranked 22 in the world. They were up at 14, as you can see. That was about four years ago. They joined the uh, international squad some way back as a teenager. Been together a long time, this pair. Their first tournament win was Belgian International eight years ago, as we look at Terry Tigerson. They were at the Olympics, they lost in the group stage in Tokyo. They have won four European Championship bronze medals as a pair. Best performance in a World Tour event. Runner-up at the uh, Indonesia Masters 
few years back. They lost in three games in the final to Polly and Rahayu. And there is their path to the semi final. So pretty similar, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Mike Fjörgaard and Sarah Thyssen, Denmark. And on my left, Cheng Fangdui and Du Yu, China. Du Yu to serve to Mike Fjörgaard, Lavo, play. So here we go in this uh, women's doubles semi-final and it's be quite difficult to know who to make the favourite here. It's going to drift wide. Good early well, leave from oh. Chen. Decision to let it go in the end from Chen. You see, there were a couple of moments in that rally when they were just a, a little uh, lack of communication. Chinese there, a new pair. Takes a little while for the chemistry to develop. Service over. Two all. Sneaky, straight down the middle. <laughs> well, Faber returned. Oh. 
That's an excellent leave. Sometimes you have so much time to think about it. Lose almost concentration, make the wrong decision. That was bang on, though. Almost missing that sideline. Five, four. Well, a little bit fortunate there. Six, too. Should have been a clean winner. A little bit lackadaisical, but got away with it. Oh! Service over. Five, Five six. six. error of judgment as well in six seven seen a few of those today which he just lost the bearings completely for some reason so they level up at seven all seven all always look like kind of match very hard to call. Service over. Eight, seven. Outlasted them really in that rally. Seven. 
longest rally of the match. Fine margins because really has been much in this. It's the odd unforced error from the Danish women. So they'll have a four-point lead at the mid-game break, the Chinese pair, 11-7 it is. to ram the advantage home here. Service over. 13, 8. That's an excellent lead. They're going to challenge it, but I think it was just wide. The body just in the way of the shuttle as it landed, so hard to see, but... Hawkeye will have the uh, definitive verdict. Well wide. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. 14-8. Play. Just starting to pull away a Chinese pair. Service ah! over. Nine fifty. Ten fifteen. 
Service over. Just too many errors at the moment from uh, the Danes. Started off quite impressively, but they just haven't been able to sustain that level. Service over. Eleven sixteen. Service over. 17 11. That's a beautiful play shot. Just three points away now from securing the opening game. Chen and Du. I wouldn't say. They've been at their absolute best, but certainly doing more than enough to stay clear of the uh, Danish girls. That's a lovely angle. Superb shot. Nothing at all that Fergard could do. Just got the end of her frame to it. Thirteen, nineteen. Over. So here are seven game points game point. for Chen and Du. Get this done in the opening game. Okay, 2014 it is, and they've got it done in pretty quick time, the opening game, just 16 First minutes. So the Danish girls playing catch-up. <laughs> Oh, 
spille opad, og så stiller sig klar. Okay. Ja, altså nogle gange vi er vi også bare nødt til at sige, at vi kan ikke springe, og så spille den opad. Ja, så, ja, så må vi bare lige puffe lidt til den, og så står klar, fordi vi bliver sgu straffet med det der med at springe ind i den, og så spille bolden opad, og så spiller den i den ned bag os. Der er vi virkelig presset, ikke? Skal vi i hvert fald få noget Ja, ellers, ja, og det er jo, det er jo særligt heroppe for Uli, ikke? Ja. Måske bare sk- altså, flere skubbe mod hjørner, hvis vi pres, eller ind mod bagmand. 20 seconds. Altså, det kan jeg godt. Det er bare ikke så... Hvis I tryk, vent, så gør jeg det. Second game. Love all. Play. So is there anything that... The Danes can do try and uh, wrestle back the initiative here. Say so it was uh, hugely one-sided first game. Challenge or not, Michael? You rest the arm. Challenge or not? Okay. One love. Service over. Two, one. A lot of open Three, court to aim at one. there. Left. Service over. By three cards. Two, four. <laughs> Service over. Five, two. Terrific placement. Same theory holds good in so many sports. Do what your opponents want you to do least. Absolutely no way either of the Danish girls could get to that. Seven, two. Just taken charge here, haven't they? Eight two ahead already in the early Eight. moments of the second game. And at the moment it's hard to see a way back for these two. Yeah. 
nine, two. Service over three nine. So they stopped that run of points, but Thank still you. a huge deficit in this second game. Almost like with every passing minute, the uh, golf in class becomes uh, more and more obvious. Play. Super shot, and it's a six point lead at the mid game interval. And as things stand, Chen and Du looking good for a place in tomorrow's final. You wouldn't have called it a mini comeback from uh, the two Danes at the end of, or towards the interval of this game, but Chinese pair have kicked on again, although that's long, I think. Service over. Yep. 6 30.
Oh, wonderful. Just the angle just kept getting acuter and acuter. Till in the end, it, it wasn't going to come back. Not the first one. Couldn't get that one. Is in, I think. Yeah. Seven fourteen. Four. Well, it looked like she had the advantage out the net for a guard. 15-7. Couldn't make it pay. Service over. 8-15. Oh, that's fantastic play from Tigerson. I think it actually surprised Do that she got that kind of an angle on it. The Chinese went sprawling. And be careful, she went down quite hard there. Yeah. Thank you. No damage done by the look of it. Once again, a lot of space to hit that winner into. Dane's on the other side of the court. Service over. 10-17. Great pressure from Fregard well, with the net. Seven. Just wonder, do the, do the two Danish women genuinely believe, did they genuinely believe at the start they could win this match? So I'm not sure how much there is between the pairs, in all honesty. More unforced errors, for sure. But this uh, second game is not a done deal just yet. Been on court just over half an hour. 
Four points in it now. Sure about the flicker and certainly wasn't particularly well executed. Well, again, excellent from Tigerson there. Trying to get themselves back in this. Not sure that Chinese pair expected this amount of fight from the Danes. Still battling away here. Tigerson serving. Huge point. They can win it. But they can't. And here are four match points to send the Chinese through into tomorrow's final. That's it, 21-17 in the second, so straight games for Chen and Du. I don't think they were at their best, but they uh, had enough firepower to dispose of Fruigard and Tigerson. And what that means, we'll have an all-Chinese women's doubles tomorrow, the young pairing of Yu Sheng Shu and Tan Ying, the teenagers. Lie in wait for these two women who get the job done in just... 36 minutes. <laughs> Certainly the uh, Danish pair had their moments, but in the end, 21-14, 21-17, 36 minutes on court, as you see, the Chinese pair safely through to tomorrow's final. So that was our sixth match, still two to go. And up next, I guess what most of the crowd have been waiting for, Carolina Marin, former Olympic champion, pride of Spain, against Gregoria Tunjun of Indonesia. That's next.
back to Madrid, where we have reached match number seven, and it's the one that I suspect most of the crowd really want to see. Carolina Marin. Heroin round these parts, up against Gregoria Tunjun of Indonesia. Here's the women's singles draw. Pivi Sindhu lying in wait 